everyone edward here uh, once again director edtech solutions and today i want to walk you through a small tool still uh, in gmail well uh, somebody just gave me a, a question and uh, let me just open my microsoft word here uh, they wanted to know how to change your gmail background theme basically how to beautify your your your, your gmail account okay so I've, I've tried to answer this one with, with uh, through a video so that it can help other people as well who might have the same questions okay now if i minimize this one let me just go straight to the browser i'm using google chrome as my case study i don't know why i know uh, yeah i love google chrome anyway i know the reason as to why i'm using this but if you happen to be using other browsers safari uh, 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 Mozilla and many others it is the same thing because once you log into the URL of Google it will present the same dashboard on all the browsers and it will be the same steps that you'll have to follow to achieve that okay now we want to see how do we change the background what is the background you see this greenish color is this green or oh, my site has a problem that is the background and this white body is where you, you, you read your mails type you compose your mails you know it is like the action uh, section and the rest of the other side is static so that's where the background goes now to access the backgrounds you simply have to come and click on settings here below your, your photo settings then go to themes okay when you head to themes these are the different types of themes you'll find here if you choose one for example which one do I want let's say I need this one it automatically be applied so that you have a glimpse of how it will be looking like you choose whether it is nice or not ah, it's a little slow I don't know whether it is a problem with my internet but Let's wait a little, a little, a little while. Otherwise, if it takes long, I'll just have to continue because basically this is it. After you select this theme, you click on it. It will be loaded in the background. Once it is loaded, we have to click save so that it is saved and it will become your default theme. Okay, it is taking long, but let's have chosen this one. Or I hover, I, so I scroll down and I pick the gardens or, or a high score. Any at the end of the day, it has to configure itself in the in the in the in the background. Let me just pick this one, okay? For example, and then I click save so that we don't waste a lot of time. And then after saving, let me check if when, when I refresh it comes. If it doesn't come, it means it was still loading. Okay. It, it doesn't normally happen to, to take all that time. But in case it does, you just don't have to get scared. Yeah, it normally depends on the speed of your computer, how many files have you loaded, and the speed of the internet. So, currently I don't know what is causing mine to slow down. But basically those are some of the reasons. Yeah. You see, even when I refresh, okay it has been changed this is it now you see how my gmail has changed so this is exactly what i wanted you to the, the middle one it maintains the color though it has another field where you have to set it also but the, the other background will be applied and this is how it will be looking yeah thank you very much for watching this video and uh, i remain edward Savume from editex solutions uh, Please subscribe to our channels and then share these videos to those people who are getting stuck or who need these, these skills to push their execution time further. Thank you very much. I sign out.